Welcome students. Let's learn about the parts of a computer. A computer consists of various parts that work together. It is therefore known as a computer system. A computer system can be divided into two parts, hardware and software. Let's learn about these parts in detail. Hardware. What is hardware? A hardware is a collection of all those parts of a computer system that we can see and touch. So these are called tangible parts. Some hardware parts are visible to us and some are not. Examples of visible parts are the monitor, mouse, speakers. These are visible to us because we can see it from outside and some parts are not visible because these are fixed inside the CPU box for example CPU chip. So what is CPU? CPU stands for Central Processing Unit and it is known as the brain of the computer. RAM, another internal part, hard disk, hard disk is used for storing data it is also fixed inside the cpu box and many other parts are there software a computer cannot work on its own it needs instruction to work so the software known as programs consists of instructions that tells a computer what to do it instructs the hardware to perform a specific task on a computer system. We can touch hardware, but we cannot touch software. Examples of different software are Windows, MS Paint. I hope all of you have used MS Paint for drawing and coloring. Word, Excel, Windows Media Player, MS Access and so on. Again, software can be divided to two types. System software, application software. So what is system software? System software helps run the computer system. It is the main software that allows the hardware parts of a computer to work properly. Operating system is an example of system software. You can use different types of application software once you install the operating system. So Windows is the most popular operating system. Mac OS, Linux. These are the most common operating system or most popular operating system. Okay application software application software is designed to perform specific tasks on the computer once the operating system is loaded you can use an application software for example calculator calculator is an application software used for doing calculations similarly wordpad wordpad is used for typing and editing text documents now let's learn about various types of application software word processing software these softwares are used to create edit and format text documents you can use search software to type anything you want like letters stories or poems some examples of word processing software are Microsoft Word and WordPad. Database software. These software programs are used to store and manage data. MS Access and Oracle are examples of database software. Spreadsheet software. These softwares are used to store data in a tabular form. 
in the tabular formats the way you write your timetable class timetable row and column wise okay you can you you can do complex calculations on the data in the spreadsheet software examples of spreadsheet software microsoft excel and google sheets multimedia software multimedia software allows us to play all forms of media such as audio video and animation including text and graphics so what are the examples of multimedia software windows media player and vlc media player with this we come to the end of this class hope you have learned about computers basic parts that is hardware and software and their differences you can download the worksheet related to this from our school website www.dpsdhanbad.edu.in under school notification icon meet you soon in the next class thank you students bye